Hi, I'm Syl. Welcome back to Slow Easy English. Today I am going to tell you the difference between debt and deficit. Um, the reason I felt that this video was necessary is because I have been watching some of the uh, political debates recently. I saw um, the one with, uh, well, the second one with Romney and Obama, and uh, I watched one between Jon Stewart and Bill O'Reilly. Uh, they aren't politicians, <laughs> but uh, they have TV shows, and they talk about politics on these TV shows a lot. Um, and one thing I noticed is in both of those, um, they misused the words debt and deficit. Um, in the presidential, in the second presidential debate, um, they talked about uh, the deficit and Romney was saying that the Obama government, the Obama administration, um, that they increased the deficit, which is not true. Um, they reduced the deficit. What increased was the debt. So let me explain what the difference is between these two words. The debt, okay? Debt is how much money you owe. Okay, so it's the total amount of money that you have to pay someone back. You borrowed it, now you have debt, you have to pay it back. The deficit, that's the amount of money that you spend more than what you make. Okay, so if, well, let me show you the examples here, okay? These are the years. Let's say we're talking about the year 2008, 2009, 2010, 2011, and 2012. Okay, now here in each column, I have the money you earn, the money you spend, the money, uh, I'm sorry, the deficit and the debt. Okay, so here in 2008, let's say you earned $25,000. Okay, you also spent $25,000 which means you didn't borrow any money from your credit cards or from your parents or from your children, okay? So you have, you, you spent the same amount that you made. That means you have a zero deficit. You also have no debt. You don't owe anyone any money because you didn't borrow any. Now let's go to the year, to the year 2009 where you made, again, every year you make the same amount of money, okay? Your boss is not giving you a raise. Maybe you need to work harder, okay? <laughs> but anyway, so you earn $25,000 every year. So in 2009, you earned $25,000, but, but you had some problems. Maybe you needed to buy a car or you needed to take a vacation, something and you spent $30,000. Now, to spend $30,000 is $5,000 more than what you made. So you had to borrow money. You had to borrow $5,000. And for this year, you had a deficit of $5,000, right? Because you spent $5,000 more than you made. And now you have a debt of $5,000, okay? So this, this debt accumulates year after year, okay? So let's look at the third year, 2010. Again, you made $25,000. Again, you spent $30,000 and you have the same deficit, right? Deficit of $5,000 because you spent 30, but made 25. Here too, you made 25, you spent 30, so your deficit is the same. For both years, you've spent $5,000 more than what you made. So your deficit is the same, but your debt 
is now $10,000. You now owe $10,000 because you borrowed $5,000 twice. Now go to, to the year 2011. Again, you make $25,000, but this time maybe you uh, took two vacations that you shouldn't have taken. Uh, so you borrowed $35,000. I'm sorry. No, you spent $35,000. So you spent how much more? You spent $10,000 more than what you made. So your deficit for this year is $10,000. But you already have a debt of $10,000. So with this $10,000 added, you now have a debt of $20,000. Okay? So as you can see, your deficit is how much more money you spent than what you made. Okay? And the debt is the total amount of money that you owe. So in the year 2012, you made $25,000 again. This time, <laughs> you took a big vacation. You spent $40,000. Here, your deficit for this year was $15,000, right? The difference between 40 and 25. So $15,000 is your deficit for 2012. And when you add this amount to the total debt, you now have $35,000 of debt in total. You see? So this amount, the debt, is the debt, I'm sorry, the, the debt is the deficit added to the previous year's debt. So here we have zero plus 5,000 is 5,000, 5,000 plus 5,000 is 10,000, 10,000 plus 10,000 is 20,000, and 20,000 plus 15,000 is 35,000. So that, my friends, is the difference between the debt and the deficit. Um, watching these debates, uh, I was kind of surprised, really, that the President of the United States and the governor running for President of the United States would actually mix these terms up. I understand everyone's human, everyone makes mistakes, but come on, this is their job. Um, you know, Bill O'Reilly and John Stewart also mixing up these terms. It's your job to talk about this. It's not my job to, well, it is now, <laughs> but come on, uh, these terms are important to know the difference and I hope that this video helped you uh, understand the difference between a debt and a deficit. Okay? Again, debt is how much money you owe. The deficit is how much money that you are spending too much every year. Okay? The opposite, by the way, the opposite of a deficit is a surplus. Right? So um, if you make $25,000 and you spend 20,000, then you don't have a deficit, you have a surplus of $5,000, right? Okay, I hope that's clear to you. If not, just go back and play this video again, and uh, I think it will become clear. Uh, you'll understand this. So, um, so that's it. If you have any questions, leave a comment. Um, I hope this video helped you. If it did, please click the like button and uh, tell other people about it. And uh, also don't forget to subscribe for more videos in the future. Thank you, bye-bye.